Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial video from IPCS Automations. In this tutorial, we are going to look at how to make an IoT device using Tinker.io IoT platform. For that, you have to just go to your web browser, search for Tinker.io. From the search results, go for the first run. In order to make an IoT device, you have to make an account with Tinker.io platform. Here I have already created an account, so that I am just really logging into my account. Once you have successfully logged in, your name username will be displayed in here and the number of connected devices first of all we are going to add a device for that click on devices from this list click on add a device you have to give a device id i am giving ipcs as the device id and a device description. I am using an Nodem view so that I am giving the device description as Nodem view and a device credential. Note that this device credential is very essential. You can generate a random device credential and just copy it down and then click on add device. Then a message like this will be displayed in your screen showing that your device is successfully added. Now launch your Arduino IDE. I had already installed Tinker.io library to my Arduino software. From ESP8266 you can select Nodem CEO. Well, this will be the source code of your IoT device. You have to give a username which is you had already given in here and your device ID. I had given IPCS as the device ID and then the device credential. Here this is your device credential. I'm copying it and then pasting it in my program in order to connect to the internet you have to give the ssid and password of your network i am using the pin digital pin d0 as output and i'm telling the thinker server that i'm using d0 pin as a digital pin which is output well this is the program now you have to upload the program into your nodem view for that select the port and your device then click on upload Now your code is successfully uploaded into your Nodem view. Go to your web browser, click on dashboards. Here you can add custom made dashboards. Add a new dashboard. I am giving the dashboard id as ipcs. Now you have to give a description. Here I am using a digital pin 0 as output. So I am giving it as E0. Now click on add dashboard. Now your dashboard is successfully created. 
Before that, let's check that whether our device is connected or not. Click on devices. Here your device is successfully connected. If it shows online like this, that means your device is successfully connected to the Tinker IO Cloud. Now go to your dashboards. Select your dashboard and in order to edit this dashboard you have to click on this button now you can add widgets in here click on add widgets select the widget type I am using a switch so that I am selecting on off state now you have to give a title for the widget since I am using DC0 pin I am giving it as DC0 and a subtitle You can select the color for your switch and the resource for this particular widget. You have to select it. Well, this is our connected device, and we had given D0 as output. Now it knows D0 is our output pin. And select that and click on save. Then you will have a widget in your dashboard now if you click on this your device will be on and you can edit this widget by clicking on this edit button you can make the changes and then save similarly you can add more widgets and you have to give program your node MCU with more IO pins well that's all for today hope you like it click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for our latest videos